Apparently, I opened a, a Spokane of worms because people in Spokane are angry because I outed them, I guess, with this ruse they've been selling. Last night on the show, I said... Another huge shout-out to Gonzaga in the Spokane area on ABC's late-night talk show, Jimmy Kimmel Live. A few puns and plenty of beauty shots of Spokane were seen all over the nation. But would he revoke his earlier joke that Gonzaga didn't exist? Not necessarily. All jokes aside, Kimmel may have actually helped the university and the city while he was ragging on us. Our hot camera working for you tonight with a story that's all new at 6 o'clock. And Hawk Visit Spokane is saying this segment was actually a huge win for Spokane. I mean, just look at our city in this sunlight. It's certainly a sight to see. Visit Spokane saying the Kimmel coverage has likely brought in millions of dollars worth of uh, exposure. Priceless as far as they say more than they could have hoped, even if it was done all in jest. So you can see there was a spike in searches there. Google lighting up after a little-known school gets mentioned on the big stage. People wanting to know, where is it? Uh, it looks like Kentucky is the most interested state <laughs> in what's going on over at Gonzaga. Uh, and Idaho also, uh, followed by Kansas. Of course, it's a huge boon for the area. It's fantastic for Spokane. It's free advertising, worth probably millions of dollars if you wanted to put a monetary value on it. Hudson, who works to promote the Lilac City for Visit Spokane, says the 12 minutes, that's right, 12 minutes Kimmel spent talking about this school and Spokane. People in Spokane are angry because I outed them, I guess. With might make its way to future tourists or those planning conventions. You don't have to sell Gonzaga students, though. Basketball is a huge part of their experience. So much energy everywhere. Everyone's just decked out in red, white, and blue. We don't have a football team, so like basketball is our football team for some schools. And so I feel like that whole like school spirit, camaraderie, just it makes like the college experience so much more like fulfilling. Those Google searches, all thanks to Kimmel, might bring in more applications. The winning basketball team certainly has. So part of it was like that really good nursing program, but I'd have to say that probably another major pull was the basketball team. Team. And while the university's administration wouldn't talk about all this buzz today, their students certainly did. I think it's about more than basketball. It's about really um, how much of a community it creates and how students are so connected to it. So, Jimmy, here you go. Like, come visit. Like, come see Gonzaga. It's a beautiful campus and, like, awesome people. And the basketball team is, like, stellar this year. And time after time, speaking with students on campus today, they tell me they've been laughing about all this Kimmel coverage, enjoying the spotlight, certainly. And that spotlight's going to be shining brightly on the Gonzaga basketball team, seeded number one, and uh, Mr. Kimmel's favorite to win. They play tomorrow. Reporting live, Hawk Amert, KXLY4 News.